If this guy was a super then I actually might forward here sometimes, but uh, this is a get in for me. Of course you do. Name! Scoop the 22 freeze out, if you don't mind. It's fun being a fatty. <coughs> oh, better out than in. Do I rip it? Samples tiny. He's a relatively aggressive. Yeah, I'm gonna rip it here. I'm gonna rip it. Hey, yeah. Uh, oh, he's got so many outs. Eight Jack Queen. Wowza Bowser, let's go. Bink. Bink. Lol, so stupid. <sighs> King High Hero calls in 2016. Lal. Nice hands, but I'm so stupid though. Alright, let's see let's see how strong these 88 Synagogues are. Can we pretty please get folds? This is close, bro, but I guess he opens his range up a little bit with that stack size. We have a suited ace. We have a lion heart. I guess we gamble. Nice. Let's fucking go. I'll defend. I'll check fold. I mean, am I betting now? Like, does he fold ace high? He will fold ace highs here. Six pairs, a nine. I can barely bet a jack in the six here. Even a nine, I suppose. I make it really nutted, decising. Oh, Kraysky with the four high. Get your pav lines out. Get your pav calculated bets out. <laughs> I'm all in. Snap with ace five of hearts. Fold king queen. Hold. Hey. Shit, what up? Oh my goodness, get fucked. Wowza Bowser! Oh, oh I gotta shake it off, that was dirty. That was dirty. Ah, I gotta shake it off, kid, that was dirty. Dirty wordy. Get your dirty wordies out, get your pap dirties out in chat. I'll flat 26 and shove 20 in the spot. Yeah, sigh. This is a call off. Please fold to me. Jack, attack, 10. Jack. Pink. Pav happy. Pav happy. 4200. Bowser Bowser. Win a flip, kid. King. King! Fuck off. GG, Jacob. Such a sigh moment here. No, we, we can start mine here, actually. I mean, I can't imagine three betting light on the first end of the final table that I open when I'm opening into, like, three larger stacks here. I'll just fucking straight set mine here, kid. And you can check back boards like this with Ace-King as well. We can take it down sometimes. We're not always just set mining. There are boards he checks back and we just take it down to showdown. We can bet here, of course. We, we can also check. Oh, yeah, he's got Ace-King. He's got Ace-King for sure. I can't imagine he ever check shops his turn, right? Get some ace high hero calls here as well sometimes. I mean, we our hand, like, we would check back with our sets. We'd check back with our pairs as well. Oh, yeah, he's got ace-king. If you've got nine, GG, but ace-king looks pretty good right about now. Ace-queen works too, kids. We're not always set mining. We're also going to win pots there. Let's fucking go, man. I'm going to enter check call mode here versus deep stack out of position. Now, I can't imagine... Okay, let me first scope him. If he's a... F no, I'm still going to bet this time regardless, but I just want to scope him first. He's locked. I just don't think a fish nor a reg will check back with Valor on this flop. I think he will check back some top pairs, but he's never going to check back like sets and two pairs because there's a lot he gets value from from me. If I get Ruskid, I hate my life, obviously. Queen Jack vs. Flop. Does he hear a call with Ace High on the turn? Ace Jack and Ace Queen, he will. So I guess I can bet here and he can call with Ace Jack and Ace Queen, and I can have sometimes like 8 9 here. Don't tell me you check back Queen Jack. That's a Ruski in my life. Can you ever value raise ace-10 here? Probably not, because I have sevens here as well. And do I ever call off with worse, worse if he raises ace-10 here? Like, I don't think- I think he just flat ace-10. <laughs> this is so sick, man. Like, it's just- how's it a bluff line? How's it a bluff line? Unless he knows my range is super capped, but it's just so sick. I imagine he- a reg- he's locked as well, and a good reg will also check the flop with, with Queen Jack, because he doesn't need to bet it, right? And he lets me catch up with hands like ace Jack and ace-queen, where he can just get my stack when he has a bow- uh, straight, sorry. What a gross spot, dude. Like, my line is value here. The thing is, like, my line is kind of polarized to either nuts or air. So he's not going to turn some weak pairs into a bluff because he can just call it down. 
I just don't. I don't see people bluff in this spot because my line is so polarized and up. <sighs> he showed it to me as well. It's a really good play by him. What a strong play by him, dude. Oh, man, I, I kind of talked myself into him thinking, into him checking back with Queen Jack real there. It was, it was like my read was Queen Jack or seventh, obviously, because he never checks back deuces on the flop. So this is a guy who bet one fifth pot with a oh. Oh, Pav Kreisky, Pav Orgasm, Pav, oh my god, let's go. Play back at me, kid. Play back at me. Snap, snap, snap. Nass burn? Nine! Nine! Oh, ho! Oh, oh, Pavy Webby does it the hard way, kid. Well, first in 2016, how about that? I'm here to take it down. How many does it pay? Three, I imagine. Ooh, 40 bucks a that's a lot of money, man. It's like, what can I get for 40 bucks, man? 40 bucks, I could buy like, a trio of new underwear for 40 bucks, like good quality underwear. I'm gonna check it back here. He bets, we can already take ace highs out of his range here, because he wouldn't limp bet ace high. And he would also limp check call ace nine here, or limp check raise it. So I'll just fly it, he'll limp stab a lot of hands here. Like five, seven. 6-7, jack-7 of clubs. We don't really turn much more equity here, do we? Versus double barrel, he's betting into the big stack here on a turn that kind of hits my range when I flat flop, right? Unless he thinks I'm flatting super wide and he's double barrels with jack-10 here. 6-7 picks up equity, I mean, I just might need to let this one go, I think. Okay, I'm gonna call it. I changed my mind last second. He was still barrel like jack-7, 10-7, 6-7, jack-10. Wowza Bowser. Did I make the correct call? I did. Pavi Wavi did. Can you believe I almost folded there? Oh, you guys would have thrown up, correct? Obviously, Pav, you had the best hand. We all knew that. Once I went to showdown, we knew you had the best hand. Boarding the 9-5, ripping the fives, getting called by a Quay 9. Hold. Hold. So many outs, we, we can't hold, right? Remarkable. Rye markable. Heads up for the win. And do I just shove now? Yeah. Lal. We bink the sit and go for $40.50. Wowza Bowser. Quads for days. God knew it was Ace Ace. He knew it, guys. He knew it. Four handed, we guarantee 325. I'm gonna just shove here. Uh, flooding is fine as well. It flops really well. We never get caught by worse by shoving. We'll just flat actually. I love this hand. Flooding. Suited Ace in position. Gonna call. Queen of Clubes, please. That'll work too. Uh, problem is though, we don't really bluff in this spot when we cold flop. We have a lot of ace high floats, and we don't really value better king ever. It's a good bluff cover. It's a bluff catcher. Nice! Lego! I mean, that was a little bit punty because... How often do you see betting ace high on a king high flop? Never. Secondly... That's about it. Like, why the fuck would I fold after you see bet and check turn? No one see if it's ace high on that board. That's 2014 strat. Get your pap dish out and chat, kids. If you don't deadly mind. Don't fall about me, good boy. Let's go. Fuck, of course you do. Pap dish, pap dish, get him out right now for the run good. Pap dish! How do they call it so much, man? How do they call it aces versus kings, fight four-handed, and now queens versus aces? Fuck me, Christ, man. How can I How can I beat that? <sighs> That's all right, guys. We've got this. Dude, he two and a half X out of position with aces for 25. He makes it three X. like, what the fuck? I mean, to be fair, three X is standardizing anyway. Right. My goodness. Swap and stacks. You take a stack. You take a stack. A stack for you. A stack for me. What is happening, man? Swapping stacks for days. This is silly now. Be kind to us, please. We've been grinding for 12 hours and 53 minutes. Cole, good luck to us. Win a flip, Pavi Wavi. Four ace five. Four ace five. I'm coming around. They call me Mohammed. Duck, duck. Jab. That was, that was a block. That wasn't a jab. That's why I don't box, kid. Wowza Bowser, that was a fun way to get there. And once again, you get a stack. You get a stack. I'll take a stack back. We just swapping stacks here. Obviously, I'm flooding. All right, kids, see about. I mean, why? <laughs> He's gonna make a sick play here, isn't he? Just turn me a fat ace, pav. A fat ace from space. 
Just don't double barrel. I mean, he bets half pot here. I just can't do anything with that top. I mean, even on top pair, I have to fold sometimes. If he shoves, like, how do I call, right? Let's just hope he's... I mean, we have to call again here. Spades can't... I mean, he knows that he can shove this river a lot, and I just can't call with one pair. He knows that, right? Thank you. Fucking thank you. Thank you. He just had a fucking hand this time. It's remarkable. All right, guys. We're shoving him for 30 on the button. So let me just double check. Oh, he's got a nine. How sick is that? Four of diamonds. Four of diamonds. Wowza Bowser! Wowza Bowser! Wowza! Oh, step on this. Wowza Bowser! Cav Wowza. Ah. Six of spoons! Run better, kid. Oh my god. You get a stack. And you get a stack. And you get a stack. And we're heads up. Let's fucking go. That was intense. I right, will limp here. I got some evil plans here if he leads. I'll check quickly. Such a shitty turn. We'll check. Pretty annoying if he bets. I mean, what about me? What if I bet? He has no ace X. He bets sevens for value. He can't call here. He does not hit this board ever. He shoves ace X pre. He'll bet a seven for value because we know we're chopping a lot. He'll bet all these nines as well. He just can't call that. If I, unless I think he's like checking back some a sex hands 15 effective preflop, which he never is. Dude, I haven't raised for 16 years. Let's start now. Let's, our first raise will be 8 5 or suit. It's been limping all fucking day, man. If we bring out the raise, it's gonna get some respect. Shouldn't be too many light 3 bets. I'm gonna check back this flop though, because C betting would make no sense by us. Bet this turn, obviously, for like one third. And if he checks river, obviously I'm betting. i oh, raise versus that sizing. It'd be a really good trap size with Queen X here. I've made it a really strong value size here as well, so it should get some respect. If I made it like 64, probably doesn't get that much respect. But 36 looks pretty nutted here. When he tanks this long, he's like never folding. What are you doing, you fucking showboater? Hurry up. Yeah. I mean, he thought about it a long time because my sizing was super nutted there. It's funny though, like, it's my first min raise in like 18 years. Take a post up, check back flop, call turn, raise river. I could not have played that any stronger, and he still called it off. So, I mean, this guy, probably a bit of a station. I'll check here. I'll check raise actually, this spot. He just back the ace of spades, I think, a decent amount as well. And he can't really, like, bet call with 8 9 in a single spade. If I make it a, a scary sizing here, like, he can't really call here with a middle spade. He has to get it in a fold. There's not many flats here. And I don't think he's going to snap that king X with a spade that quick. And if he had a single king, he'd bet a lot larger than that. This is pav- this is pav fucking strat right here, man. That's why I'm keeping my limps, like, consistent. I'm tanking for, like, at least a second or two. I'm not just snap limping it. And obviously we're calling here. It's a very nutted sizing, but we have to call here. Getting two and a bit to one. We're at 28% here in position with 5 6 two, we definitely have. When SPR is 3, am I just, like, getting this in right now? He doesn't really have much of a jack X raising. Like, he's not going to 2.5 egg shack, right? He's going to just shove up pre, or at least, like, make it... A little bit larger. I'm worried about like aces, that's it right now. With the pot this large and a lot of scary turns, I'm gonna rip it in if he has like an overpair than GG. But I feel like Ace Jack is just shoving. I feel like a lot of his strong hands are shoving pre. I feel like he's either got garbage just like raising here. 4 3, 67 I'm yards. Rip in, guys. Aces. Fuck that, me, she gone. She wow. gone. Do six. Wow. Shit, aces. Either way, guys, seven, thanks five. for being here. We cashed for 564, 19. Plus 245.73. 809 dollars We made $297 today. Anyway. GG, and I'll see you tomorrow. Hopefully. That means I'm making deep runs. Wabby. Oh, Travi Wabby's on a 3 bit rip ace queen. I'm going to snap it off. I can feel it. Hoo -hoo -hoo! Oh, Travi Wabby. You just got to be a nit like me. You... Oh, ace queen. Oh, fuck tits. Hold. Hold.